How many years have you been coming to Comic Con? Geez, my first Comic Con was 2001, so like 40 years. I'm not good with math. Um, but uh, no, it's been 15, 16, 17 years. I really need to get the number right, but I think it's about my seventh Comic Con. First time Comic Con I went uh, a couple years ago, and then we did New York Comic Con, so this is my third Comic Con total. But it's my second year coming for work. All the other times I was just coming for fun. I think I've been here the last seven or eight years. Um, but this is obviously my first Walking Dead experience. Yeah, my first Comic-Con was with my small publishing company, Funkatron, and I was at the far end of the hall, uh, watching people walk by my table, you know, going, hey, hey, come over here, let me talk to you about my comics. Uh, and uh, it's, uh, it's changed, you know, dramatically from there. Comic-Con, the first time I came here, I was able to walk the floor. Now I, I have to wear pigeon masks. My first time at Comic-Con was season two. So I was uh, super nervous. I was like, oh my God, there's so many people here. The first time that we went out uh, on the Nerd HQ panel and we saw people in cosplay as the clones, that was the best <laughs> moment ever. Oh, there was a cat today in the audience. There was just, we were talking to this, we were on a stage, a small panel, not the big panel. and. And I just kept looking at this one man that was dressed as a cat. He was a fully a cat. I've uh, been coming here for so long that it seems perfectly natural to me. You know, uh, other people think it's weird that there's so many people dressing up, but it's just always been that way. So it's like, these are my peeps, you know, I feel it's just a homecoming. You know, and you see people dressed as you everywhere, or, you know, dressed as other characters or wearing shirts with Walking Dead. And then now, like, all the badges for Comic-Con are us. And I don't think I'm going to get the opportunity to go to the floor this year, which is a shame because I love going down there and seeing what I, all the new stuff that they got going on, grabbing some toys, grabbing some artwork. The experience yesterday after the panel going onto the floor and signing autographs, I've never seen anything like that. The, just the walking through the main floor. Not often and you get to see your hand-picked fans, but they get a chance to interact with you and you kind of give back a little bit. So it's, it's a unique situation. These are our friends here and we've been part of this group from the beginning. So we're very thankful to have this crowd with us and we try really hard to entertain them and keep them invested in the show and keep it real. This is the spiritual home of our show and many, many other shows that are here. And so it does feel very thrilling to come here like on a school trip with all of our cast mates, show the trailer and have a swim in the sea and mess around with all the fans. You know, this is a celebration of enthusiasm. You know, it's death by spandex.